Here alone are my true friends and dear intimates who make me remember the God's name. Such is the Lord by listening to whose word all the comforts are obtained, by whose service the death's couriers are repulsed, by whose support the mind finds prop, by whose meditation the face becomes bright. The Lord's servitors, the Lord himself exalts. Nanak seeks their shelter and is ever a sacrifice unto them. Suhi so fifth Guru, neither God-like persons nor gods last in this world. The silent sages too, after performing services, get up and go. Living forever are seen those who have meditated on the Lord. In the company of the holy, they obtain Lord's sight. Kings, rulers, merchants, all shall die. Whosoever is seen, him the death shall consume. The mortal attaches and clings to the false worldly attachments, leaving behind everything when one departs, then ultimately he regrets. O the treyer of mercy, bless thou Nanak with this boon, that night and day he may meditate on thy name. Suhi fifth Guru, amongst all the hearts abidest thou, O Lord. The entire creation is strung upon thy thread. Thou art my beloved and thou the support of my very life. By seeing and beholding thee, my mind has blossomed. Wandering, wandering and wandering through many existences, I have grown weary. I have now taken shelter with my holy people. Thou, O Lord, art inaccessible, incomprehensible, invisible and infinite. Day and night, Nanak meditates on thee, O God. Suhi, so fifth Guru, of what avail is the greatness of the worldly valuables which take no time to disappear? This world is a dream, but one in sleep does not know it. In an unconscious state, he is clung to it. The thoughtless man is bewitched by great worldly attachments. Before the eyes, the eyes of all, he arises and departs. The highest of the high is his coat. Innumerable beings he destroys and creates. No other like him ever was, nor shall there be. Contemplate thou, O Nanak, that one Lord alone. Suhi, so fifth Guru, in remembering him, live I. I wash thy lotus feet and drink the wash, O Lord. He, my Lord, is the knower of inner self. The Lord abides by the side of devotees. Hearing, hearing thy nectar name, I meditate on it.